coming up on tomorrow's teachings. These gas prices are ridiculous. How am I supposed to pay for this? <sighs> and 17 miles left, great. Six dollars? Six dollars. You know if the government's gonna steal from us, then I'm gonna steal. Oh shoot. I have work in an hour. Hey, Tom, it, is there any way you can cover for me? <laughs> I, I came down with something, I think, and I don't think it's a good idea for me to come in. <clears throat> oh, really? Oh, thank you, man. You're a lifesaver. All right. Talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> He's such a loser. He'll believe anything. I'm sorry, Grandma. I, look, I just, my coworker's sick. I got called in, and I, I gotta take it for him. I'm just trying to be a good person. I'm sorry I can't take care of you today. Hey, I'm doing it all for you. All this money is going straight to you, okay? All right, I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Oh, God. Empty? 
I just filled it up. I just came back from the gas station. What? It's like 60, 70 bucks worth. Empty? What? What the heck? Hey! Are you... Sp Marty? What are you doing? I, you're sp I thought you said you're sick. <coughs> <coughs> You're stealing gas. Did you steal gas out of my car? I'm on empty. You obviously did. Have you been doing this to all the cars around here? I, I didn't know that was your car. So what? Dude, I, I was co I'm covering for you. My grandma's sick right now. I'm supposed to take care of her. And I'm covering your shift for you because I think you're sick. But out here, you're stealing gas out of people's cars? What do you, what's going on? Look. I, the gas prices are so high now, I can't afford it. Like, I can't pay my rent. I Dude, I know the gas prices are high right now, but so what? I have to work for it. Everyone has to. It doesn't mean you have to go steal gas out of people's tanks. That's ridiculous, dude. That's just being lazy. You're making excuses. That's not okay. Look, Marty, I'm gonna have to call the cops. Tom, you're right. You're absolutely right. Um, I had no right. It was very selfish of me, it's especially when people have worse way worse problems than I'm experiencing in the world and your grandma's sick and I just, I feel bad, just, I feel bad just before, before you call the cops, just at least let me put the gas back so then, you know, nobody else is immediately affected. So before they take me away, I, I I'm sorry. That would be really good, Marty. I, I bet everyone would love that, especially me. You wanna go put it in my car right now? A absolutely. Absolutely. I, I'll get started on that right away. <laughs> Let's go. Even though Tom called the cops, Marty still wanted to give all the gas back to the cars that he took from because he knew it was the right thing to do. He learned his lesson and took responsibility for what he did. Hey guys, this is Killian Howe from Tomorrow's Teachings. Stealing is wrong, and we shouldn't be taking other people's property. How would you feel if someone else took something of yours? It's not a good feeling, so don't do it to others, especially in hard times. There's no excuse, and there's always another way. We all live together here on this beautiful planet, and we want to make the world a better place one video at a time. So if you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to Tomorrow's Teachings. We make new videos every Monday and Friday. Let's spread awareness of our journey and make this world a better place.